Hello you from Dubai Airport. Uh, this is where the journey begins. Got the mask on because it is uh, mandatory here. Just about to board my Emirates flight to uh, Bangkok and we're boarding from here, which he doesn't say it, but it is uh, gate C19. I desperately hope that is not a precursor uh, to my PCR test result. So here we go then, gate C19 at Dubai Airport. Let the revels begin. Hello you, I'm Big Fat Bestie. And welcome to the Slam Bang Glamorama three week trip of dreams. So it's gonna be a little bit of an odd one, this one. It's gonna be a little walk and talk. <laughs> and it's very dark here. Can't really see what the heck is going on. Uh, but we're gonna wait for the lift. I just wanna have a quick chat about um, what's open and what isn't open. I'll take my mask off for you uh, once we're out of, the, uh, out of the lift. It's all a bit like a nightclub in here. Very uh, silver and chrome. So straight into it then, um, what is open, what isn't open? In Bangkok, May the 2nd, uh, 2022. Those little bars on Soy 7, uh, the ones which you knew about two and a half years ago, uh, they're not open anymore, uh, or not open currently. Nala Plaza and Soy Cowboy, well they're about 70% about open I would say, something like that, about 70%. That's a little bit better, it's a bit brighter. So as I was saying, Bangkok, uh, Soy Cowboy, and also Nana Plaza, they're about uh, 60 to 70% open. Uh, in Nana Plaza, um, some of your favorite bars, um, Billboard is open. Um, also, all the Rainbow Group uh, bars are open as well in Nana, and my favorite, Spanky's, is open as well. Spanky's is open. Angel Witch, not open. Angel Witch is closed. So about, as I said, about 30, 35% of uh, bars are still closed. Uh, I want to give you a couple of tips. I'm going to fling you around right here. Um, newbie tips. So here is the reception area. And this hotel in particular, and quite a few others, will uh, ask you uh, for a deposit. So I'm staying here for three nights. The deposit for those three nights uh, is 2,000 baht a night, 6,000 baht. So if you whack it on your credit card, that's fine. They'll take an imprint, uh, no issues with that. However, if you, like me, have only got a debit card, you're gonna get charged that full amount and then you're gonna get doubly screwed on the exchange rate uh, when they put it back in again. So there is an option, uh, like I did, to leave your deposit in cash and then you just get it back in cash and uh, it won't cost you uh, anything. That's my first newbie tip. It's a nice atrium, the chandelier. Uh, but another thing I wanted to show you um, is just outside here. It's right in the middle of uh, Circumvit Road. And if you wanted to stay in the middle of it, if you prefer Nana Plaza, then by all means, go down there, nearer to Soy 4. If you prefer Soy Cowboy, you can go up this end, um, nearer to uh, Terminal 21. But there's a lot going on right in the middle. So from here, you can walk to Nana and also uh, to Cowboy. And just around here as well, give you another quick tip as well. Everything on this side, the soys are odd numbered. Everything on that side, uh, the soys are even numbered. They don't necessarily correspond so if you're coming here with a friend or a group of you and you're staying on different soys, for example here, I'm directly between soy 13 and soy 15, but on the other side of the road, right there, that's soy 10. So they don't necessarily correspond uh, between the two. So you can uh, bear that one in mind. So you walk straight down there to Nana Plaza and actually literally about 300 yards down there you'll find the uh, Nana BTS. This walkway up here all the way down there leads to the Asok BTS and let me show you this. Uh, by the way masks compulsory inside and outside still in Bangkok May the 2nd 2022. 
just want to show you this right in the middle so just coming up here is uh, soy 15 so just before you sort of before soy 15 you've got this the Rancher Hotel and the Ferme coffee shop legendary and if you are out here on a night time you will see it all kicking off here on the street it is absolute freelancers galore uh, lady boys galore as well so I just want to show you a little bit of the uh, sights and sounds of Sucumbit Roads and a few of my thoughts as well I'll tell you what I can do you see what I can do cunningly I can go into the smoking area here and as long as you've got a cigarette on the go you don't need your mask so maybe it'll be uh, better if I talk to you uh, about uh, my thoughts Son's mask but I've got nothing to uh, put the stand the camera up on there you go that's better so you don't want my ugly mug do you we'll get some sights and sounds of Bangkok so as to my thoughts are things back to normal they're getting back to normal they're not quite there yet um, I went down Cowboy the night before last I went down Nana Plaza last night um, it's not as busy as normal although there are certain bars certainly in Cowboy so there's one bar and I can't remember its name but it's got a rock band in one bit of it right at one end and the go-go is actually off of the end of, uh, of Soy Cowboy so it's not the Terminal 21 end I'm talking about uh, it's the other end and uh, there had a fantastic lineup and also was really 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 busy beer prices at the moment uh, in Cowboy it was 180 uh, for a bottle of Tiger and in Spanky's in Nana so one I can remember uh, it was 170 baht uh, for a bottle of Tiger so this is the hotel I'll be reviewing for you and hopefully it will be up tomorrow on reviews day Tuesday um, great hotel absolutely loving it so far and then after a couple more days I'll be uh, heading off to Pattaya and we'll be uh, checking out what the scene is like down there so just a quickie from me today um, to say uh, thank you for watching the live stream thank you for all your uh, nice comments saying that it's uh, nice to see me back well it's nice to be back uh, as well so for those of you who've watched all this way and watched this far what do you reckon beard or no beard it's pretty hot and sweaty to have the beard but if I shave it off I'm gonna look like a fat school kid in the comments below let me know I'm gonna leave it up to you guys beard or no beard uh, I'm Big Fat Bestie uh, it's nice to be back in Thailand and uh, keep tuned or stay tuned for all the uh, latest updates on what I'll be uh, getting up to there will be five uh, hotel reviews uh, on this trip I'm trying to call it the uh, five-star hotels for the price of a travel lodge in the UK so stay tuned for that that'll be coming up and uh, as I get some more intel and some more info and some more tips of trade uh, I will let you know thanks for watching this one just a short one take care see you soon and vlog off